Let's face it, 2020 was a very tough year. Fortunately, here at First Prez, we were blessed with innovative and thoughtful leaders who were able to switch gears and keep things going. FPC's elders and deacons, along with our staff and other congregational members, provided support through worship, opportunities for study, and social opportunities. They kept in touch with our members with calls, cards, and care bags, and continued helping those in need both internationally and locally. But now it's 2021 and we have the opportunity to follow our current paths and to begin some new ones. Let's check in with the Congregational Nominating Committee and see what their plans are for finding some new leaders to help with that. So the first sort of business is to figure out how we're going to gather nominations for next year's group of elders, deacons, and Congregational Nominating Committee members. Um, what did we do before? Uh, let's see. We made an announcement from the pulpit on Sunday morning. We put nominating cards in the pews and we hung out during coffee hour afterwards to talk with folks and gather names. Mm. Well, that's certainly not going to work this year. I don't know. What do you guys think we could do? I don't understand. You're a person of great faith. You obviously care about the members of First Press. Why can't I nominate you to be a deacon? Well, Dan, that's really kind, but I already have a job. All right. This one is going to be for an elder. Hey, Linda. Yep, I'm ready for CNC. We just need one more elder candidate. And you know, this church is so full of wonderful, faithful people. I think I'm just going to pick the next person that walks through the door. Oh, hi. hi. What's your name? Owen. How old are you? Ten. Okay, maybe that'll work. I bet you're full of fresh ideas and lots of energy. We're not gonna leave this to chance. The CNC is looking for caring and committed individuals who are willing to serve as deacons, elders, or on the church nominating committee. In order to do that, we're gonna need the guidance of the Holy Spirit and suggestions from you, the congregation. A nomination form has been mailed with a letter to every household. We ask that you read it and prayerfully consider whether you or someone you know is being called to serve as an elder, a deacon, or on the church nominating committee. If so, fill out the form, drop it in the mail, or bring it to the church office by February 1st. Or if you prefer, you can go to the church website and fill out a form online. We look forward to hearing from you and thank you for your help.